Okay, so let's make a navigation link real project example to understand the navigation link correctly. Uh, we will make a new group for navigation link and you can drag your navigation link folder under main. We will list step by step like this and let's open new groups first it is view model and let's open again inside navigation link new group called views okay so let's make files for them right click on views and open new file with swift ui view uh, name it product view or product list view we will list the product inside this view also we should have a new swift ui file for product detail view to navigate the detail of product from list and also last view with swift ui it is navigation link view this is main view for navigation link we're just gonna write inside this product list view that's it just for destination in our course view model if you remember we had destination view object right so we will put destination view navigation link that's why i made navigation link view for making same name as a course tutorial name okay so let's go back to product list view so to list our informations our products we should have a view model right so let's make a view model and list the product open new file with swift and name it product here open new struct and write product make it identifiable and we have three objects first id it will be uuid and next it is product name string and let description also string under product struct we will list our product so open new let product list and type getting from product struct and open new array for listing products so i will do copy paste my real project like this i have five different products so also you make for yourself list it like this product a and product b c d e and also descriptions okay we forgot to add equal after product so you should add it okay i think description word is i was right wrong so fix this write description like this and now we can build our project okay very nice so go back to product list to list the products first of all we will call our product here write model and with array call your product struct like this and open list write model okay so here we will use navigation link the destination is product detail we will go to the product detail with this list and the label it will just be a simple text so write product dot name and call your product list model inside your preview in model write product list so let's build project okay also i think we should call inside this click on this and write product list so let's go back to product list view and again reload your preview okay perfect so we see our product but 
we can't navigate to them. That's why, because we should use navigation view, but I will use it in navigation link view, not in product list view. So write navigation view inside content, put your code, and now we can navigate them. You can see it's changed the color from gray to black. So now when I navigate to my navigation detail, I saw hello world. So let's also redesign our product detail page. First and first, let's call our model. So write let product equal to product. Let's open new VStack. If you don't know what is VStack, it is a vertical items. Like you will put your items under each other. It will be vertical. Also, we have edge stack that is horizontal stack. It's next each other, the items. So in this case, we will use the V stack to make items under each other. Let's display and product on preview to see the result of designing. So click on fix and let's add a product information. So for name, write product A, also write this is product A description. Okay, very nice. Let's go back to VStack. First of all, we will display our text, write product.name and make it font title. Also make it bold. So I will display a icon with system name shipping box that fill okay we can see the preview we should go to our product list view and call our product so write product equal to product by selecting from list okay let's go back to detail page and let's see the preview okay great we have product a and the box so again open font System and size, let's say 60. Let's make foreground color gray. Also, we can change opacity to 0 0.5. Write product and description. Add a padding, make it bold, and make it multi-line text alignment to center. Okay, great, looks nice. So we can also add to spacing to VStack like maybe we can add 20 and delete content here and also let's add padding and ultra thin material background like this and also we can make corner radius 10 lastly we can add navigation title with product.name okay great so let's go back to product list and let's test our project how it's look like uh, sorry navigation link view okay so let's click on product a we can see product a and description also let's try product b also we can see product b that's great go to product list view and under list call navigation title write product let's go to course view model inside main we just made destination a text now we have navigation link view right so let's call navigation link view like this so now if we go to sidebar and click on navigation link that is a real navigation link destination you can see the product but if you see the products it's going to bottom right we should make better go to navigation link view we don't need navigation view here because we call navigation view in sidebar so we can't call again so again click on navigation link now it's better and also we see navigation title from product detail 
go to content view and delete vstack call sidebar and click on run so let's run with iphone 14 pro so let's see how it looks like we see our sidebar navigation title tutorial list and one of the course item so it's called navigation link so let's click on it and we have products also we can display products with all details 